Fair informs us that a majority of the young people who turned up during the KDF recruitment were turned away due to some being underweight. Actually, a, a lot of them were underweight. And some allege that it is due to excessive chewing of um, goka and cat. Uh, and uh, joining us to tell us a little bit more about that is Nikki Gitonga. Nikki, a big challenge there. A lot of the youths were underweight. Give us some of the numbers, how many were turned away, at least in specific regions, and what are some of the reasons that they are giving? Uh, uh, thank you, Waiga. We are getting you live from uh, Kwale County here at uh, Kona ya Umsa. It's within Ukunda town. Uh, as you have just said, that actually uh, most of the youth uh, in Kwale County who had turned up for KDF recruitment were turned away uh, due to what, uh, according to the KDF, uh, the guy who was in charge of the recruitment, uh, most of them uh, were underweight. For example, in uh, Msamboni constituency, over 150 youth who had turned up for the recruitment were even turned away due to the same thing. Uh, the other thing, even uh, uh, the whole of, uh, four, I mean, uh, four constituencies we have Msambweni, Kinango, and Lunga Lunga, and even Matuga, uh, the same case was due to uh, the underwear. So I, want, I just want to get some of the uh, voice call from the youth here, uh, just to get to, to know what exactly could be the problem, why, why is it that most of them are underway that has caused them not to join uh, KEDF. Uh, maybe uh, my cameraman can just walk with me, I have some of the youth who are going to talk about uh, the same issue uh, concerning uh, them not being recruited to KDF. Pengine kijana utaanza tu kwa majina. Unafikiria ni nini asa ilifanya baadhi ya vijana wengi katika kaunti ya kwale kutopua na fasi ya kujunga na jeshi la taifa? Kwa majina naitua Salim Masa. Mi naona kwa sabu hiyo naona kame kuna ufisadi lada kwa sababu serikali pe inangalia inangalia sana pesa mishona. Eh, na sisi so kwa eti kama wanavosema kwa, kwa sabu ya weiti zetu sijui atufikishi Lakini mi najua ufisadi ndo ukombele sana serikali inaangalia watu wenye, wenye kama hauna kitu uwezi chukulua muhimu eh, Lakini uh, kuna dino uh, je, idara jeshi nataka watu ambona zaidi ya kilo msina mbili Na ambapo wengi wenu umlipatikana na kilo arubaini ya rubena nane Sasa hiyo sunuana hiyo tari ya hamfikishi hiyo kilo Sasa hiyo kilo ni sawa kuwa kufikisha mtu kilo anaitajika kuwa na kilo hamsini. Lakini kama mtu amepasi ame kila kitu, kwa kilo kwa hiyo inamana ye anaeza. Kama mtu anakilo arubena nane ama arubena tisa. Hiyo mtu so kuwa anaeza kuwa anatemwa. Hiyo mtu anaeza kuchukuliwa kazi na hiyo kilo ikawa ye kwa sabu atakuwa anafanya mazoezi na nini. Hiyo kilo anaeza tu waka akafikisha. Yeah. Wacha nipate mzee pengine unafikiri ni vijana wenu huku wengi hawana kilo. Pale zile tumezungumza nayo kasema ni ni njaa ama ni nini. Unaweza simama. Mimi naitwa Mwemeji Mwaiga. Kwa sababu ya hizo kikwa recruitment kwa mpaka apate kilo 150 kilo 50 ndio hiyo. Kwa sababu ni upande wa makazi huko kwetu ni magumu. Kama mimi kutoka nianze sija sija kuwa na kazi ya permanent ili ni kazi ya ya juu watu una juu wapana juu wapana sasa hizo kilo na makulaji ni haya ya shida tapata vipi kilo hizo kwa hivyo nategemea kwamba ni upate ujira mzuri ipo zile kilo uwa zida zinaungezeka ipo ile kazi na uzo kupata kiraisi na napili kwamba hita sirikali yenyewe bia inaangalia ikiwa pengine kilo zako ni hizo kidogo Nataka pia kwa kilo wa msini, no, arubana tano, ama arubana chisa. Mwandike kwa sababu wakata kifarifuna zoezi, na kenda kule, kule, kule kuno kula, pia nangezeka ile kilo. Kwa hizo kilo, kilo mbili, si mtu wawo wawo nafanya wafati kazi, niya pate kazi kilo kule mbili, kule mbili, anawangeza. Tupane kijana mungine wambu. Ok, the la, one last youth. Eh? Uh, Mimi na ito Hassan Alfani. <coughs> eh, naona hawa mazigira kwa sababu tunasumbuluwa na astare, ugoka nini kwa vile vijana wengi ya wana kazi. Well, we apologize for interrupting that live broadcast.